Uh, I thought that was a very average performance from my team. I thought they came out in the first four minutes and played really good. Um, still had a lot of mental breakdowns offensively. Still had a lot of mental breakdowns defensively. A little concerned about that, um, that we have to correct to get to where we want to get to. So, um, you know, it, you can't play to your opponent. You try to get better every game, and we didn't, we didn't, do, we didn't do much to show that we got better today. Um, so that's about how I feel about it. I don't, I don't know about that, but um, you know they kept playing hard and they kept, they kept fouling us, and we just had, to, we played a lot of guys. A lot of guys got minutes. Um, a lot of guys are weeding themselves out, and a lot of guys are showing that they should play more. Well, it shouldn't be hard at all. Not when um, we've given games away and, and not been really productive in certain games. But, you know, I just told them this game's about getting better. And, you know, I thought it was, a, I thought it was an average performance. Um, and we got to continue to get work. We got to get to work and keep getting better. It's hard, it's hard to get fo- – it's hard to – there shouldn't be any reason not to stay focused. I mean, it doesn't matter if you're up three or you're up 20. Um, you know, you're, you're trying to get better. You're having, you know, we're playing 11 guys, and some of these guys are getting to play, and some of them are, are going to do it by their performance on minutes, are going to eliminate themselves down the stretch. So, you know, I hope, I hope they were focused. Uh, we got some guys that have been here for three years. We got some guys that have been here for two years and have made the same mental mistakes offensively that we got to correct. It's always good to get a win. I'm, I mean, it's, um, we won a game and it was good, um, but we've got to continue to get better. We got a tough game on Wednesday, and you know our guys have to get focused on what's going on and, and how they're going to get better. It's you know it's one of those things. It's 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 hard with this day and age with social media, Facebook, and all that to keep the fact that they were two and eighteen coming in, and our guys think it's just going to be a walk in the park, and that's not what I told them, and it's not what I expected. I wanted them to go out and play as hard as they could and get better. Um, I thought some of our guys got better. I thought some of our defense was really, really good in this, the first half, and then I thought we had a real, real big lull in the second half. I think we were just playing like you played when you're in a playground. You score, I score, you score, I score, you score, I score. And we didn't, you know, the first four-minute game, it was basically even. And that can't happen at your, at your home court. When you're talking about, obviously, they knew the 2-18 coming in, even though that's not what you had been preparing for. Did you see that coming in in the days ahead, or is that just today? I mean, did you think practice, they were focused? Yeah, I thought they were real focused at practice, but it's, it's another thing when they get in the game. It's hard to sometimes um, get your game to carry it out to the, you know, from practice to the games, but... You know, I, this bunch plays hard. My 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 guys play hard. It's just that I have bigger plans for them, and sometimes I'm a little upset, or I seem a little upset because I I want them to be so successful. I want them to win at a high high level, and it's like I told them today. They, you know, we're we're six and three at the midpoint. If if uh, we could have done better, so now if we can do better in the second half, anything can happen. In order to get to that high level that you speak of, where where does this team need to improve most? Well, we have to be more consistent on the foul line. You can't shoot 12 for 22. Uh, you can't turn the ball over as much as we did. You know, careless overs. Um, you know, when you're up 15, 16, 17 points, they have to learn that it's still hit singles, hit singles, hit singles, not try to home run, home run, home run. If you hit singles, hit singles and you're up 15, it goes to 30. If you try to hit home runs and you don't make the plays, then it can go down to 10. And that's what they got to get. They got to get that killer instinct where when it comes late in the game with five minutes to go, we don't have any slippage. And we've had slippage at that area this year. And that's one thing that I'm trying to teach them. Uh, and, you know, they're doing everything they can. But um, sometimes you, you, you don't get it done. And we got to get better at it. The 21.4% shooting they had in the first half of the season, low for a half for an opponent. Uh, for an opponent, can you 
Talk a little bit more about the defense in the first half and what you guys were doing that, that seemed to be working so well. Well, I think this team, as we talked about, I think this team's done a really good job. I think we're athletic, we're long, we got good quickness, we can change up defenses, keep people off guard, especially after timeouts. Uh, we're able to pressure a little bit. I thought we were real active with our hands in the first half. Um, and then, yeah, I mean, I think they, they took some questionable shots that kind of help you. But, you know, that's part of it. And, you know, I thought they did a nice job in the first half. How good is it to get this many guys extensive minutes? I mean, almost everyone with, with 10 plus minutes. Uh, it's always good to play 11 guys, but. I think it's kind of, I mean, you guys cover basketball. I think it's unheard of. You play 11 guys like that. So, you know, I, I don't know if it'll change really quick, but, um, you know, we we're, I don't think we're going to be able to play 11 guys going down the stretch unless we get in foul trouble or we we have guys that don't have enough energy or are tired or playing hard and we need subs or foul trouble. You guys had 26 eight points in the paint yeah, I think they were there. You know, that's one thing we wanted to do. We wanted to get the ball inside and pound the paint and, and drive it and try to get to the line. Um, I thought we did a good job getting to the line in the second half. Uh, we didn't shoot free throws very well, but um, O and JJ just get a little excited once in a while. I mean, they, they're getting better. Yeah, I mean, some for games I think tonight they just got a little excited because they, you know, and then when you get in a hurry, then it's it's not it's not always productive when you get in a hurry, if that makes sense. Coach, how can you get consistency out of, out of Jordan? Sometimes it looks like he's out there, he's got a lot of intensity, and then other nights it's, he just seems stagnant. Is there, is there anything from a coaching standpoint you can do? To I've done everything I can, anything that I've thought of. I mean, all I can do is give him chances and keep giving him chances, but the you know opportunities are going to run out because the guys playing in front of him are pretty good. I mean, they're they're playing pretty consistent. And Joe's being a freshman, but um, that's why I'm you know I'm, I'm giving him every chance I can, and and he's got to he's got to start producing. I don't know what else I can do coaching wise. I've tried everything I can with him. How does this team match up with uh, Air Force this second time Well, it's it's just difficult because they play that. Princeton style offense and then you have to make a decision how you're going to play that game and if you're going to zone them a lot last time we zoned them a lot so uh, it's always a tough place to play and, and our guys have played pretty good on the road we just got to continue uh, to try to get better and we're going to have to make some shots and make some plays in the paint and uh, you know try to figure out how to play better in zone I think, I think we're getting a little bit better but we still got a long way to go Thanks, everybody. Appreciate it.